The coronavirus pandemic has sparked one of the largest surges in gun sales in decades as millions of Americans seek protection. Uh, it's been unprecedented. Um, we've never seen anything like this. So we were pretty happy when the Department of Homeland Security came out with that guidance a couple of days ago and said, no, gun stores are essential. Gun manufacturers are essential and you can't close them. The surge in gun buyers has caused the FBI's National Instant Background Check System to backlog, creating delays for many Americans. In March alone, 3.7 million background checks were completed, the highest number for a single month in the system's 21-year history. What's causing the delays is exactly what we said would cause them in the mid-1990s when they were talking about foisting the system on the American people. The computers and the personnel can't handle the huge number of gun buyers that are coming through the system now. There's people that are perfectly qualified, legitimate to buy a gun, and they can't, but for a logjam in the system. And that is unacceptable, and that needs to end.